So Wind Vision sets out a vision for the industry to get to 20% of the energy mix by 2030. And that's going from 5% now to 20% in 2030. What that would do for the industry is give a long-term plan, a long-term target to reach. And if we break that down to what does that mean in the short term, it's about 10 gigawatts a year on average between now and 2030. On an annual basis, uh, it means that we can continue to grow the jobs that are in the industry from about 50,000 at the moment to about 400,000 by the time we get to 2030. And so that's giving long-term certainty to the workforce in this industry. If we have some, um, some stability and some predictability for the industry, the industry has already shown that it can ramp up, it can gear up, and it can bring costs down quite dramatically. We're very pleased the Department of Energy has renewed the 20% by 2030 uh, wind vision. We're actually, as a country, tracking ahead of the megawatts of wind installed required to meet those goals. What it means for our company and for many companies and communities in the U.S. is the retention of the 10 gigawatts of manufacturing, domestic manufacturing infrastructure that's been built and the tens of thousands of U.S. jobs that have been created by the U.S. wind industry. We're currently active in 20 states with 27 of these new wind farms now under development. Uh, about 25 local partners, these leading entrepreneurs in wind-rich communities around the country with whom we're developing, many of them for a second or a third time. And we have about $4 billion worth of potential infrastructure in our pipeline today. Much of that can be built out over the next five or so years if we just get that long-term stable policy in place and if we have that wind vision target to work toward in the future. We're talking about jobs and economic development in, in local communities in terms of the suppliers of, of the parts and services for the, for the wind turbines as well as uh, money that gets into the hands of farmers and ranchers who are hosting these wind projects. Uh, so it, it's really a great way to revitalize many communities around the country. At the same time, we're meeting the nation's needs for clean energy. This Wind Vision report shows how wind energy is already providing economic and environmental benefits to the United States. If we're able to get stable federal policy over the next five years, we can double the amount of wind energy provided to the country and thereby provide more economic and environmental benefits. We can do this.